I got a new camera for doing some of my videos here and I'm excited to try it out. It's kind of cool, a little uh, gimbal so I can move my hand around all over and it just kind of stays in place. Which looks really cool and it's connected to my phone too. But I'm excited to try this out. It's better than what my phone's camera is, obviously, otherwise I wouldn't have gotten it, but it has some cool features and whatnot, so I'll give this a go. Maybe I'll be able to have a bit better videos in the future. Okay, now I'm just doing a test. This will see uh, how well it picks up sound and tracks my movement. Just kind of cool to have it follow me around. track me there. Oh. Now I'm just checking uh, how well it records when it's not too uh, not too bright in here. I don't have any lights on in my garage but the door and window are open on that side there. So that's only light in here. Okay. It looks like it actually uh, seems to keep me pretty well lit. It still tracks my face pretty good. Right now it's recording at 4K at 24 frames per second. And as I come outside, it sort of exposes me a bit and adjusts and... Yeah. I think now I might just clean up all these uh, logs I got sitting all over the ground here. Oh, now it's pointing up. And then I might go out to the jack pines and shoot some guns and see how see how it does. I'll try and film some slow mo of a couple semi-auto gun shooting. See how that turns out.
Okay, so after doing a few tests, the uh, the camera seems to be performing pretty good. I recorded most of the uh, non-slow-mo videos in 4K, but I'm um, I'm editing all the videos together in Adobe Rush on my phone, and I don't have the premium one, so I cannot export it in um, 4K. So it all, or this video is going to end up being in 1080, I think. So I don't know if that's going to make the video look worse since it has to compress 4K into 1080. So I'll see how that does. I'm still not really sure what uh, software I should be using to edit my videos. So after uh, trying out a couple, I might actually pay for one of the full versions instead of just using the partial versions if I find one I like. So yeah, so far I'm liking my camera and I'm looking forward to doing more videos, using it for more, oh, it's losing track of me, doing uh, more videos of stuff I build and me using it. So, yeah, thanks for watching. One other thing, uh, I'm, I'm really happy with the sound quality of this camera compared to, my face is pretty dark compared to this guy, so it's, it's getting really confused, it seems. It'll probably hold better if I hold the phone up, or a camera up higher. Um, yeah, anyway, the, oh, oh, jeez. Having issues now. I think that's mostly just from how overcast and bright looking this guy is right now. But yeah, the, the audio compared to my phone is much better. So I'm happy with that and it actually came with a little wireless microphone so I can clip one onto my shirt if I'm doing something away from the camera, like if I'm taking a wide angle or something like that. So it'll, it'll make recording videos a lot easier, I'll have a bit less wind noise and whatnot, so yeah. Thanks for watching.